Hey everyone, good morning to everyone. I just want to go ahead and thank everyone for joining me this Monday, or not Monday, but Sunday morning. Um, so I'm just going to let a few people join before I get started. But as always, this is Natalie Carmona here with Madam Glam. And I'm going to be swatching this beautiful collection. Um, so I'm like I said, I'm just going to let a few people join and then we'll get right into this video. Um, and then as always, since I'm going to be swatching the collection, I can't answer all of your questions now, but I would definitely be addressing them in the story after the live ends. So just, um, you know, keep that in mind as I'm doing this. Don't get frustrated. Don't get mad at me because I'm not answering your question. Just, you know, keep commenting your questions and then we'll answer them at the end of the live. Uh, let's see. Okay, I'm going to start when we get to 100 people. So, again, good morning to everyone. Yeah, the colors are so pretty, y'all. Like, y'all know, like, fall is definitely my favorite time of the year. Well, like, starting in fall, my birthday is November 1st. So, like, this time of the year is my all-time favorite. Let's see... Okay, I guess we're going to go ahead and get started. So as I mentioned just a few minutes ago, uh, since I'm going to be swatching this collection, I can't answer everyone's questions, but we'll be sure to answer all of the questions at the end of the live. But the name of this collection is called The Wicked, and it is inspired by um, the the uh wizard of oz yes inspired by the wizard of oz um so all of the names are gonna be um you know related to that um so as you can see we have some beautiful colors they're so pretty we have a good variety i mean we have the fall and then we still have some that you know are a little bit lighter so you get a little bit of everything in there and then also as always i am gonna be swatching this collection and giving it away at the end of the live and all you have to do in order to enter the giveaway is just comment down below and let me know how will you how will you be spending your Halloween this year I know for me as I mentioned my birthday is November 1st so I was just telling my boyfriend this morning that we should do a Halloween costume party so most likely that's how I'm gonna be spending my Halloween but how are you gonna be spending yours be sure to let me know down in the comments and then at the end of the live I'm gonna be choosing a random winner but you have to make sure that you stay throughout the entire live so you um you know can claim your prize but i'm gonna go ahead and show you the colors that i have already swatched so i went ahead and swatched five of them to make this you know live a little bit um quicker you know so we're not i'm not taking up all of your time but this is what the first five look like and i'm gonna go ahead and mention the names so the first one is like a off like a kind of like a off red color um and this is the color this is oz that's the first one that i swatched we have this green one which is in the color the wicked witch that is what it looks like really pretty i love the greens yes this collection is like i said inspired by the wizard of oz so it is a fall collection the next one we have is like a bluish color and this one is really pretty because it has a little bit of shimmer and really all three of these do and that one is sapphire city but y'all look how pretty that is yeah, that teal one is super cute, y'all. It's super, super cute. Next, we have this yellow one, which is in the color Candy Muncher. That's what it looks like. And yeah, we definitely, with everything that's going on, we definitely can't do too much for, you know, this year's Halloween. But last year for Halloween, I was in Orlando at Disneyland or Disney World, what, whichever one it is. But anyways, this other one is, is a silver or gray one, but it has like little shit, a little bit of like silver shimmer. You can't really see it. But that one is in the name Tin Men. So those were the ones that I've already swatched. Again, this is what they look like. And now I'm going to go ahead and swatch these. Um, so the first one that I'm going to do is in the color uh, Cowardly Lion. And like I said, all of these are inspired by 
um, the Wizard of Oz. So I'm going to go ahead and swatch this one. And of course, I always do two coats. And then I'll also be doing a little fall or Halloween design at the end. And then as always, as you guys know, all of Madame Glam's gel polishes are nine free. They're cruelty free. Um, they go on super, super, oh, sorry. <laughs> they go on super, super easily. And I just absolutely love them. So again, that one is in the color Cowardly Lion. Next, I'm going to go in with this really pretty pink, like a really cute pink. And this one is in the color Le Tutu or Toto. Is it Tutu or Toto? Whatever it is, but it's super cute. And I know that I'm going to love it. Y'all know that I'm a pink girl and it's definitely like, a, oh, this is so pretty. And I noticed that a lot of their colors, like a lot of these have like some sort of shimmer to it. Because this one I can tell that has some in there as well. Um, but like these two right now, these are like solid color. But all of these have a little bit of shimmer. And it's like the same shimmer. Um, so it's so cute. Next we have Miss Dorothy. And this one looks like it's just going to be a solid red. It doesn't look like it has any shimmer to it. Yeah, Simply, who is that? Simply Laquita. Yeah, Cowardly Line is so cute. Here lately, I've really been loving orange. Um, I really, like, I don't know, like, out of nowhere, like, I really just started liking it, as well as Emerald Green. They're just so pretty to me. Okay, so that one, like you see, is like just a solid red, and that again is Miss Dorothy. And then I think we have these two. So y'all know that this is always like my favorite one, which is like a burnt orange color, kind of. That one's like a burnt orange, almost brownish color. So I'm going to leave that one for last, but I'm going to do this one, which is Kansas City. And it's like a really pretty blue color, which y'all here lately, I also really been liking blue. Like, I don't know. I've always been a pink person. Like, I always go for pink, but not so long ago, like maybe two weeks ago, I had blue on my nails. I just did gel polish. And it was so cute. But again, that is this is Kansas Sky. And then lastly, we have Scarecrow. So this one looks um almost okay. So it kind of I thought it was like a burnt orange, but it's more of a brownish color. But it's so cute. This is so freaking pretty. And again, this is Scarecrow. And remember, if you just are now joining us, um, just to be a part of the giveaway, because I'm going to give out this whole entire collection, or Madam Glam is, um, but you have to just comment down below and let me know um, how will you be spending your Halloween this year. I know it's not much we can do, especially with the kids. You know, not everybody wants to have the kids out. Um, but I know, like, I mean, people were talking about doing, like, little in-home Halloween parties for their kids or whatever. So I know a lot of people will be doing that. Uh, like I said, my birthday is November 1st, so most likely I'll be doing something for Halloween. I'm not really sure yet. But definitely agree. Someone said staying home and keeping safe. Definitely agree with you. Okay, so that was the first coat. So now I'm going to go ahead and go in with the second coat. And the first five that I swatched, I already did two coats and the top coat. Um, so now I'm going to go through and do a second coat of the other five. So again, the first one is Cowardly Lion. So I'm going to go ahead and do a second coat of that one. And this one, y'all, I know someone else really liked this one. It's so cute. Okay. Okay. That is Cowardly Lion. Next, we have this really pink, uh, light pink, which is Le to is Toto. Is it Toto? I think uh, I looked it up, y'all, but I forgot the pronunciation. <laughs> And I honestly don't think that I've ever watched The Wizard of Oz. Like, don't judge me, but I don't think I have. And I don't know, y'all. Like, I'm not really a huge, like, movie person. I only watch things that I want to watch, if that makes sense. So don't judge me. <laughs> but um, again, that was the pink one. Next, we have uh, the Miss Dorothy, which is the red one. And this one is super cute. Like sometimes it's kind of hard to like find like a true red. This one is definitely really cute. So again, that is Miss Dorothy. I might 
might have watched The Wizard of Oz. I can't. I'm not really sure. I think when I went to New York, we were going to watch it like, um, like do a, like a Broadway show and watch that. But I don't think that we ever did. I know that at school, when I was in high school, they did a play. And that's why I do like remember some of it. But yeah. So that blue one again was Kansas Sky. And then next, we're going to go in with the last one, which is Scarecrow. And then after that, we're going to care for 30 seconds. And as I mentioned earlier, y'all, um, all of their gel polishes are cruelty-free. They're also nine-free. And they also always have a promo code. They always have sales going on. They do have the VIP program, which allows you to get for you know, like first dibs. Is that what you call it? Dibs on like all of the sales, also free shipping. So make sure that you go check them out. You guys know that they are my all-time favorite. So I'm gonna go ahead and put those back under the light for 30 seconds and as always i am using my holly light also by madam glam and i've been using it for a while and everyone always gives, gives me compliments because it's so colorful and so cute so i definitely recommend this light if you're looking for something um really good and pretty as well so i'm gonna go ahead and close all of these up and then i am gonna be doing um a design i think i'm gonna do like something halloween-ish uh let's see hold on i don't know if i want to do it over the color that i already have or i don't know i probably uh, i don't know let me go ahead and do the top coat on those for now i'm also using the madam glam gel top coat which is the non-wipe top coat and i absolutely love it um it's so shiny and i use it on all of my clients and their nails always last you know they're always really shiny even whenever they come back after two three weeks they're still you know they still look really really good and my top coat i'll always cure for 60 seconds okay so now they're going back under the light Okay, and I think for my design, I want to use the orange one because that's more Halloween-ish. So I'm going to go ahead and put that one over to the side. And then I think I want to use, let's see. I'm going to use my black one as well, which is the Madam Glam Perfect Black. Let's see, let's see, let's see what I'm going to do. Someone said do a candy corn. Oh. I already have something in mind that I'm going to do, so we'll see. Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and take them out. Let's see. Turn that off. So I think I want to do a... Let's see. I'm just going to do it over here. So this is the Cowardly Lion. Y'all didn't even have to look at the name. I remembered. So this is Cowardly Lion. And I'm going to... Let's see. Put a little bit right there. I'm going to get my nail art brush. Y'all need to really go to the... pump. That was what I had planned for today was to go to the pumpkin patch and get some pumpkins. And I want to get some haystacks and a few other things for like um, the outside of my house. But I just didn't feel like it today. Okay, and for this one, I'm going to leave the background clear and then I'm going to draw like a little pumpkin at the tip of the nail. So I just kind of did the outline and then I'm just going to fill it in. And late, I know before I used to do a lot of my nail art with like regular nail polish, but now I've just been doing everything with gel polish. You just have to make sure that you have a good brush to work with. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put that under the light for 30 seconds. And then I'm going to go in with my black one. And again, that is Perfect Black by Madam Glam. Yeah, I always love, Madam Glam is always really good about naming their polishes. They always come up with like some really unique names. And then also with coming up with like, you know, different themes for their um, collections. I absolutely love, you know, the things that they come up with. 
some things I'd be like, dang, I would have never like, you know, thought of that name for that polish, but then it ends up like going perfect with that color. So whoever does that, whoever's in charge of naming their polishes, you are doing such a wonderful job. Let's see. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pull it out. So I'm gonna go in and do a second coat of those really quickly. I don't wanna hold y'all up for too long. Okay. So I did a second coat. I'm only gonna care for 15 seconds, which even at 15 seconds, they still dry super cute. I mean, not super cute, but super fast. Yeah, the the um perfect black, you can never go wrong with the perfect black. I always got to make sure that I keep one in stock because you are always going to use it. You're always going to need it for something. So now I'm going to go in with my black. And first, I'm going to go in and work on my pumpkin. So hopefully you guys got a good view. So I'm just going to go in and outline the top first. Let's see. Y'all gotta be a little quiet when I do this so I can concentrate. So just bear with me as I do this. Hold on. And then we're gonna draw the lines going down. Okay, just like that. Do it look like a pumpkin, y'all? I don't want it to look like a um, like a basketball, <laughs> but that's my little pumpkin. And I'm gonna go in and add a little bit more here in a second. And then for this one, I'm gonna do. I think I want to do a spider web. So I'm just gonna do that. This, and then another one right here. And maybe another one right hold on right there and then i'm gonna go in and draw the little lines I know y'all are super quiet, but just bear with me. Okay, just like that. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put this back under the light for 30 seconds and let that black cure. Okay, so here, as soon as I'm done with that, I'm gonna go through and choose the winner um, of the collection. So remember, all you have to do is just comment down below and let us know what you're gonna be doing for this Halloween. And then you have to be here whenever I announce the winner because you have to claim your prize. Let me go ahead and arrange this right here. Okay, so for my pumpkin, I kind of want to leave it like that, but I think I'm going to go in and add, let's see. I'm going to add maybe, let's see. Like some little eyes in the mouth and the face. I mean like, you know, the little, yeah, the eyes and then the nose and mouth. And then the nose, oh, it looks evil. And then the mouth is just gonna be a zigzag. Okay, just like that. So now I'm gonna go ahead and cure those again for 30 seconds. That, 
Ich, okay, let's see. Just arranging these. Oops. Y'all, I have so, like, I've gotten so much polish on this Madame Glam matte that I'm steady, like, moving it over to the side. And every time that I record, I have to move it a little bit over to the side to keep from, like, you guys seeing the stains. But it's just polish. But, yeah. Okay, so now, lastly, let's see. I'm just going to go in with a little bit of this yellow and just do, like, a tiny dot in, like, in that black just like this for the eyes that's kind of cute that's actually cute y'all so now i'm gonna go ahead and cure that again and then after that i'm just gonna go in and apply the top coat let's see yeah but all of the colors are definitely super cute i as always i'm never disappointed they always come through with like the most beautiful colors. Okay, now I'm just going in and doing the top coat on both of these. My pumpkin definitely came out a lot cuter than the spider web, but you know, you guys get the point. <laughs> Yeah, I, def I think uh, someone said they love their Madame Glenn's polishes and they have almost close to 300. I think I counted mine once and I was like around the 300s. Um, but I know I have a lot more because I have more in like um, boxes. <laughs> so I know I have a lot. Yes, so someone said, oh, that would be so cute. Someone said the pink and the gray would look so cute with like a sweater design. I definitely agree with you. And now like I, if you don't recreate it, like I definitely will have to recreate that because that would be so cute. Okay, let's see. I'm going to go. It's only five seconds left. So, um, okay, so this is the collection, which is called the wicked and i hope you guys liked it and then this was my two little hold on that was my two little designs that i created using the color um cowardly line like i remembered again i didn't even have to look at it <laughs> but um let's see so now i'm just gonna go through and just scroll through the comments to pick a winner and remember you have to be in this live in order to claim your prize Let's see. So I'm just going to close my eyes and I'm just going to scroll, 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 scroll through the comments. And I'm just going to like whatever my finger lands on, that's going to be whoever wins this collection. And if you don't win, as always, you know, I do this every first Sunday of the month. So you have plenty of chances to win. So, OK, so I just opened my eyes and my finger landed on Chantel Burton. She said, I'll be eating lots of sweets and chocolates in bed for Halloween. And girl, trust me, if I don't end up doing anything for my birthday, let's see. <laughs> if I don't end up doing anything for my birthday, that's definitely what I'll be doing. So again, the winner for this collection is Chantel Burton. So if you're here, let me know. And then also, um, be sure to email your information over to Madam Glam and their email is help at madamglam.com. I'm going to give Chantel a few more minutes or seconds. Okay, she, here she go, girl. I was about to pick another winner. But congratulations to Chantel. You are the winner of the Wicked Collection. So lucky you. Um, but again, that is all of the colors from this collection. Super, super cute. So congratulations to you. So again, Chantel, make sure that you email your shipping information to Madam Glam and their email is help at madamglam.com and I'm going to give you guys another closer look of the colors before I go um but see and sorry y'all look I was in a rush but that is the colors of the collection and here they go again 
So congratulations one more time, Chantel, on winning this collection. Be sure to contact Madam Glam. And as always, this was Natalie Carmona with Madam Glam. And remember, I'll be doing this every first Sunday of the month. So make sure that you stay tuned. Make sure that you follow Madam Glam. Also follow me on Instagram at getnail32. And I will see you guys next month. Um, I'll probably be doing this, what, I think the next one falls on my birthday my birthday is november 1st so we'll have to see if we're gonna do it on my birthday if or not i don't know y'all if i have a party i don't know if i'm gonna be able to wake up but anyways um as always i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and chantel make sure you go ahead and email them so you can get your collection as soon as possible but i'll see you guys next time and i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day